Day or night, it's Hessenite. So I had just did my Mrs. Afton video, scheduled, edited, recorded, went to make the fan art for it, all that jazz, all done. And then I was scrolling through the Afton family tag on Tumblr because Tumblr. And then I had this idea that day, that exact day when it was all finished, and I thought about this theory. So, disclaimers real quick. I have personally not seen the FNAF movie. All the information I have is secondhand. Um, I'm not paying for Peacock. I'd rather pay for the DVD when it comes out. I'm not paying for Peacock. I already have too many streaming services and there's nothing else I'd want to watch on Peacock. And I'd rather ha have the ability to pause the movie due to my anxiety. So, huge disclaimer there. I will also be referring to Crying Child as Cassidy throughout the video because, long theory short, I think we've had Crying Childs and the one you should not have killed since names mixed up. Watch previous theory videos for more. So first, Vanessa in the movie is William Starr, which was weird to me at first because often only has three kids. Michael, Elizabeth, Cassidy, and I was thinking, why do I believe that? Well, the Afton family staff thoughts, obviously. Mom at the head, William to her left, Lizzie to her right, Mike next to Liz, Cassidy next to dear old dad, unless we take Vanessa's therapy tapes into account. Vanessa's last name in the AR files had an A for her last name. And then in her therapy tapes, we get a bit about her childhood. She had a father named Bill, which is short for William, and her mom's dead, assumably departing this world by her own hand after losing a custody battle. Suddenly, the five-person Afton family makes sense. It's not Mrs. Afton at the head of the table, it's Vanessa, the only Afton born in Afton, left. She's rebuilding her family. It could explain how Burn Trap so easily manipulated her. She thought her father was telling her what to do, and if she is like his other kids, she's used to this. Michael went to sister location like William told him. Elizabeth should have listened, and now she's vowed to make Daddy proud. Vanessa probably did exactly what she was told, especially after hearing what happened to Elizabeth and Cassidy. They were told not to go near the animatronics. Look where they ended up. From her point, even Michael disappeared. This also fits the Afton builds special things for his female children. Again, watch previous videos on the ser this series for context not with Cassidy. Theme 2. Elizabeth got Baby, Cassidy got the Fred Burr plush, and Vanessa got the Vanny mask. But isn't Vanessa a Elizabeth parallel? Yeah, but... Her, Gregory, and Freddie are assumed to be parallels of Afton's dead children. And who'd make a better parallel to Elizabeth than a sister? Honestly, if Vanessa is an Afton in the game verse, I couldn't see her being much younger than Cassidy birth order wise. Here's how I see the Afton birth order Michael, Elizabeth, and Cassidy. How does Vanessa factor in? I could see her either being Elizabeth's twin, a kid between Lizzie and Cassidy, or Cassidy's twin. That doesn't really affect her being an Afton, though. That's just personal headcanon type stuff. Here's why Vanessa being an Afton matters. Vanessa's backstory explains the absence of Mrs. Afton. She and William divorced long ago, and after losing custody of battle, likely due to Elizabeth and Vanessa following William's instructions and testifying against her, she ends her own life. Vanessa's the only one to hear heed her father's warnings about the animatronics and watches one by one as the rest of her family dies. Mom, then Cassidy, then Elizabeth. Then her father disappears, and eventually even Michael, who took care of her when William disappears, disappeared. Elizabeth is primed by the trauma of losing her family and William's controlling nature to be swayed by burn trap or mimic and not opening that can of worms today, whatever glitch trap is, not opening it. Anyways, it convinced her to go back to work for what used to be the family business and continue 
good old dad's side projects. I don't know how to end this video. I don't really have a plan to end. I just had this revelation and I want to know if other people think the same after hearing that in the movie, Vanessa is William's daughter. So another way to look at the staff bot Afton table is it, it is the five persons and it does include the mom is just Fanny would be at the other end of the table. I don't know. It was just a fun theory idea that I think was really cool and everything can expect Afton somehow with this series. So I don't know, man. I thought it was interesting.